Hey guys, it's Queen DJ, and in today's video, <clears throat> I will be reacting to to episode 4 of Wandering Witch. Let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. <sighs> Push that back. Really? Well, of course, because she's a princess and he's a cook. Hmm. But then something happened, right? Okay, so from what I remember... Because I saw the preview for this on Monday morning. Um, this might be my favorite episode. I don't know. Because it seems like we're going into darker territories and routes. I mean, last week's episodes with the two-parter stories, um, or really the short stories in two episodes in one, were really two interesting stories that I really honestly liked. But I feel like this episode, from what I saw last week from the preview on Monday, well, not even last week, a couple of days ago, um, <clears throat> this is supposed to be a really dark episode. I don't know. I have been avoiding-ish about this on Twitter because I woke up late. I woke up at like one going on, almost maybe 12 going on one, and then kind of, I didn't start until about like one thirty going on two. And... Jujutsu came out and I was like fuck it I'm just gonna have that come out first but uh, I just really want to know what happened because it's been eating at me since Monday <laughs> excuse me The princess without subjects. Yeah, I saw that and I was just like, I don't know how to feel about that. But that is pretty, but... Oh, God. And that has to be their daughter, maybe? Right? It would have been in, like, the newspaper. Oh, but there is! Oh, teddy bear. Oh. Yeah, this might be my favorite episode. Yeah. So you might as well stay here. The fact that that is just nothing but soot, like holy shit. So sad. Hmm? The forest field? That was weird. <clears throat> oh my god. Is it me or is the does the castle look like um what is the the uh the monument in Moscow, Russia? Oh, okay, well shit. I mean, it, you know, is that really necessary though? I mean, you I mean, she can fix the door. I get that, but still
And that must be their, her mom and dad. No, the princess, her grandfather. That could be her. Oh. Oh, that is her. She pretty. So, um, princess, why do you live here alone? Her voice is familiar. Okay, I'm gonna call you Rose for short. So, um, Rose, <laughs> back to my question. Yeah. You don't know. That's a little weird. And so you've been here all alone ever since? Mm, that makes sense. Do you have stuff like papers with your name on it? Yeah, a letter. Yeah. Okay. What if it was her who wrote this? Why? Why what's outside? Something about this is fishy. What do you see? What the hell? A dragon? But everyone's already dead except you. So it's looking for you. Exactly. If you flee during the day. No, because that force field. Oh crap, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> Oh, you're a witch, too. Hmm. Mm hmm I mean, of course, yes. <laughs> a second letter or anything? Yeah, I'm gonna take that back. I don't think it's her who wrote this letter. It could have been her parents. Seventh day. Yeah. 
Well, what do you have, though? What can you do? I mean, yes, you're a witch, but... It's only been a week since you woke up. What the fuck? What if she's reincarnated? Like, every single time on the eighth day when she die, um tries, she possibly dies? Pfft, hell no, ma. <laughs> I mean, she's just being truthful, though. I mean, Elena's is just here. You fell asleep quick. <laughs> I don't even know if I could sleep with a demon out like that out there. I mean, hmm. I'd be too scared. So then she does all the cooking herself. But then what happens if you run out of food? <laughs> yeah. really because your body retains memories of things that you did. Oh, that looks so good. You see that bread? Oh my god. Oh, I mean, I just ate, but oh, that bread looks so good. <laughs> the details on damn bacon Jesus Okay. I don't know that smile. Don't trust that little smirk and that laugh. Possibly. Mm, okay, that could work. I mean, now if it flies, then we fucked. <sighs> Did you finish? Is it weird she kind of gives me, like, Rose gives me, like, major Queen Barrel vibes from Sailor Moon? Or, like, any other type of anime villain, like, female-wise? I don't know. Like, I like her, but I just don't trust her at the same time. Do you see that smirk? Don't trust that. Do not trust that. I, I swear to God, this plan is gonna backfire for some weird reason. 
she's pretty. I mean, I'll give you that, but like, I don't know. Pretty and deadly. Girl? Boy? <laughs> what? <laughs> just honestly. Yeah, maybe to, just to see. But you feel like you know her. Well, it seems like everything's going smoothly. I don't know, this could all backfire in like under two seconds. Come on, a little bit more. There we go. Oh, she's killing it. Oh! I, I, I mean, but yeah. I, I, I thought she would just... Oh. Um... What what are you gonna do? Oh. Is that her mom? I mean, do we need the swords? Holy shit. And it's still getting up?
Okay, so... Of course. Girl! So basically, yeah, yeah, woo. And in the end, you killed your own father. So you're just gonna stay here? You're not gonna leave? Um... It's pretty though. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um. Woo. Oh, hold up. Are you telling me the princess was Lane? <laughs> oh my god. Hold up. Stop it. <laughs> oh my god. Are you serious? Jesus Christ. Lane. Woman! Oh my god! <laughs> Yo! Oh god, Jesus! This is a really dark episode! Yeah, this is honestly my favorite. Oh god! I wasn't expecting it to go down like that. I wasn't expecting, you know, the demon to be her father and stuff. And now, you know... She's living, she's still living at the castle alone, but she's now imagining her unborn child and her. <sighs> beloved dead husband, or, well, almost husband. And living the rest of her life out. Girl! I might have to watch this episode again, because Jesus! Oh my god! Oh. I'm so happy I didn't get spoiled on this. Because if I did, I would have been so pissed. Like, damn. Are you serious? Like, that didn't just happen. Oh, my God. Like, this girl literally, because her father said no about the fact that those two were in love. And that they couldn't be together and immediately executed, you know, her beloved girl was like, fuck that, I'm gonna revenge. I mean, so then, damn, the king and his own wife and his own people. And he knew it even while he was, oh my god, Jesus, like, that, that's like if an Attack on Titan... Well, yeah, they, they kind of did that in Attack on Titan. I think some of them did really realize that, you know, hey... Even though inside, like, I'm still a human and I'm a titan and it's like that. I'm still eating people and there's nothing else I can do to stop it. But, oh my god. Like, 
I, I don't know where you can go from here. I'm just going to say episode five to the end of this series really going to have to step up because these this episode and last week's episodes honestly have to be the two best episodes for going into dark gritty moments and I do like that in shows sometimes but it always it depends on like how dark you want to go I mean if it went like one of my personal favorite dark magical girl animes and that's magical girl rising project like magical girl rising project as the first season and if you've ever read any of the light novels it's really dark but it's like so good now like magical girl site um, it's good. It could be better at times, but like if we're talking about just a girl who just wanted to be a witch and everything and going through dark things like this, this takes the cake. I mean, these two episodes gave me kind of feels to like Chilling Adventures of Sabrina and the ish that Sabrina deals with on a daily basis, even though like the current we're waiting for the final season and ish and I'm so upset about it. But I was not expecting it to go down this way. I'm thinking like, you know, we just gonna kill this thing to kill it. She ain't gonna have no remorse. And I'm sitting over here, I'm like, oh my god, yeah, she about to kill this thing. I'm starting to feel bad for it and everything. But then when she said, father, you, you want to be like, hold the fuck up. Like, time out real quick. Like, what you do? <laughs> like, oh my god. But her reasoning on why she did it. I understand that, but now she's still alone at the end of the day. She has no one, and I mean, oh god, I, I really want to read this light novel, because if this story is in the light novel, Jesus, like, it, I, I can't, because these last three stories was bomb, good, I, I mean, 10 out of 10 would recommend just for these episodes, because, like, Oh, I, I mean, they can only go up from here. I hope next week's episode is really good, but this was honestly probably one of my favorites. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode four of Wandering Witch. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Magical Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Friday for episode five. Bye, guys.